The song You Remain was co-written with a friend of mine who is a worship leader in Arkansas. For the longest time, the song only consisted of three verses. And each verse begins by describing something of this world that changes and will one day cease to exist altogether. For instance, even now today, the stars will burn out and they'll fall from the sky. And one day the sun's not going to rise on this earth. And the most beautiful things, like music and melody, along with the worst of things, like mankind's constant struggle between what's right and what's wrong, will cease to exist. But we know that one thing remains forever, and that's God. The chorus of this song wasn't written until just a couple of days before we actually tracked the song for the record. And since each verse talks about things of this world that will one day cease to exist, we wanted to contrast that lyrically in the chorus by speaking about God's eternal faithfulness to be constant and consistent and unfailing in His very nature. And I can remember slipping off into a room upstairs at the Kirk in the middle of July and writing the words, God, you remain, you are always the same. The leaves may change and blow away, but faithful and true are the colors of you, more beautiful than could be explained. God, you remain.